The eastern United States, commonly referred to as the American East or simply the East, is a region roughly coinciding with the boundaries of the United States established in the 1783 Treaty of Paris, which bounded the new country to the west along the Mississippi River. It is geographically diverse, spanning the northeast and southeast as well as the eastern part of the central United States. In 2011 the 26 states east of the Mississippi in addition to Washington, D.C. but not including the small portions of Louisiana and Minnesota east of the river had an estimated population of 179,948,346 or 58.28% of the total U.S. population of 308,745,358 excluding Puerto Rico. Southern United States The southern United States constitutes a large region in the southeastern and south-central United States, usually enumerated as the following, Kentucky, Tennessee, Virginia, West Virginia, Maryland, North Carolina, South Carolina, Georgia, Florida, Alabama, Mississippi, Arkansas, and Louisiana, all of these are also considered to number among the eastern United States. Its unique cultural and historic heritage includes the following aspects Native Americans Early European settlements of English, Scots-Irish, Scottish and German heritage Importation of hundreds of thousands of enslaved Africans Growth of a large proportion of African Americans in the population Reliance on slave labor Legacy of the Confederacy after the American Civil War, these led to the South developing distinctive customs, literature, musical styles, and varied cuisines, that have profoundly shaped traditional American culture. Many aspects of the South's culture remain deeply rooted in the American Civil War. In the last few decades, the southern U.S. has been attracting domestic and international migrants, and the American South is among the fastest-growing areas in the United States. New England. New England is a region of the United States located in the northeastern corner of the country, bounded by the Atlantic Ocean, Canada and the state of New York, consisting of the modern states of Maine, New Hampshire, Vermont, Massachusetts, Rhode Island, and Connecticut. In one of the earliest English settlements in the New World, English pilgrims from Europe first settled in New England in 1620, in the colony of Plymouth. In the late 18th century, the New England colonies would be among the first North American British colonies to demonstrate ambitions of independence from the British Crown, although they would later threaten secession over the War of 1812 between the United States and Britain. New England produced the first examples of American literature and philosophy and was home to the beginnings of free public education. In the 19th century, it played a prominent role in the movement to abolish slavery in the United States. It was the first region of the United States to be transformed by the Industrial Revolution. Historically an area in which parts were strongly Republican, it is now a region with one of the highest levels of support for the Democratic Party in the United States, with the majority of voters in every state voting for the Democrats in the 1992, 1996, 2004, 2008, 2012 and 2016 presidential elections, and every state but New Hampshire voting for Al Gore in 2000. The Midwest The Midwestern United States in the US generally referred to as the Midwest is one of the four geographic regions within the United States that are recognized by the United States Census Bureau. Seven states in the central and inland northeastern U.S., traditionally considered to be part of the Midwest, can also be classified as being part of the eastern United States, Illinois, Indiana, Iowa, Michigan, Minnesota, Ohio, and Wisconsin. A 2006 Census Bureau estimate put the population at 66,217,736. The United States Census Bureau divides this region into the east-north-central states essentially the Great Lakes states and the west-north-central states. Chicago is the largest city in the region, followed by Indianapolis and Columbus. Chicago has the largest metropolitan statistical area, followed by Detroit, and Minneapolis, St. Paul. Sault Ste. Marie, Michigan is the oldest city in the region, having been founded by French missionaries and explorers in 1668. The term Midwest has been in common use for over 100 years. 
Another term sometimes applied to the same general region is, "...the heartland". Other designations for the region have fallen into disuse, such as the "...northwest", or "...old northwest", from "...northwest territory", and "...mid-America". Since the book Middletown appeared in 1929, sociologists have often used Midwestern cities and the Midwest generally as typical of the entire nation. The region has a higher employment to population ratio, the percentage of employed people at least 16 years old than the Northeast, the West, the South, or the Sun Belt states. Four of the states associated with the Midwestern United States, Kansas, Nebraska, North Dakota, and South Dakota are also traditionally referred to as belonging in part to the Great Plains region. Topic: Major population centers. The following is a list of the 24 largest cities in the East by population. Topic: See also East coast of the United States Eastern Canada Territories of the United States on stamps References External links <references>